What's going on world? It's your boy Big Chips here with the Diamond Dream Team representing Simple Freedom. Today we are here to go over how to do a Google Hangout. There are three way or three different style hangouts to, that you can do. So we're going to show you all three. Well, I'm going to show you how to do all three and then we're going to get involved. But today is brought to you by Awaken Thunder by Wake Up Now. All natural, no sugar, 10 calories. Bet your bottom dollar this stuff's good. So let's jump in the screen and let's get started. All right, so here we are with our, our main YouTube page. This is how I set up a Hangout when I'm going to record because I put it on a web page so that people can go to my web page. And look, if you're a part of our team in Simple Freedom, you understand that we have pages that we use for our Hangouts. This is how we do it. You basically come up here and just press Upload. Now on the upload, there are. this is basically if you're going to do anything really, but they have the webcam capture if you want to do a live recording right then and there. But all you do is hit broadcast Google Hangout on air. So that's one way. All right. Put your name in your Hangout. Add people if you want. Bing, boom, pal. You're done. All right. So I'll show you this real fast just so you can see it. Uh, testing two because I already tried to do this a sec one time and it didn't work so now we're gonna start hangout on air so this might actually have all right well I, I forgot I'm, I'm, on, I'm on my camera up here so I don't have a camera right here so I can't show you what it's gonna be but basically all it's gonna do is it's gonna load so when we load the next one it's gonna be identical there are no differences whatsoever so that's how you do it. It gives you links right here that you can send out for your YouTube page or you can embed on your blog. Now here's the caveat. Uh, I, if you're gonna, going to embed it on a page, I would make it larger than the 420. All right, so if unless you're using like an optimized press or some kind of video player that's already in, in, set up in your blog, Make sure the page is full width. There's no sidebar, no header, none of that stuff. Make a special page just for your Hangouts, and that way it looks clean. It's crisp. So that's what you can do there. If you want you know, folks to come on as a panelist where they are also live with their camera and their microphone, then you would get this link up here in the URL browser uh, title section here. All right, so there's that. I'm gonna go ahead and end this one because we're gonna come back and do this again, all right? The second way to do this, well, I've already got that window open, shh, our little secret, but is to be on your actual Gmail account, click on your icon, and hit View Profile. This is gonna take you to Google+, and that's where you're gonna find it. So up here where it says Profile, just hover over it, it pulls down a drop-down menu, and go to Hangouts. Now here's where you're going to see the two. Now you can either do uh, that way or just go to plus.google.com forward slash hangouts and it will take you to this page too, just so you know. All right. So what we're going to do is there, there are two types of videos in this section. Number one, there is your hangouts on air. This is what we were just doing on the YouTube page, except this one has a little bit of a twist. That's why I said there's three. All right. And then there's video hangouts. Video hangouts are are not recorded. They are just for you and maybe if you're working with a team member, somebody's having some issues, if, you, if they don't have Skype or they don't want to do video on Facebook, Google Hangouts is a great way to get your team together and share some value. I do this every week with my team. We get together, except we record it for our team. But we get together all the time, so that's one way to do it. But on this example, I'm going to show you that third way, and this is how you see people creating events for their uh, Hangout. So what you're going to do is click on the Hangouts on Air, and all you're going to do is literally hit Start Hangouts on Air. Now, let's show you this real fast. Now on this one, these are not people I'm associated with, but these are people who have Hangouts that are going live right now. So you can browse through at all the live Hangouts. If you see something you like, you want to join in, join in, you know, if they allow you. <laughs> if not, go watch it. But uh, click Start Hangouts on Air. Now here's the, here's the difference. 
on this one we're just gonna do testing out for a video testing out for a video uh, showing how to do a live hangout <laughs> right while doing a live video it's a little different now here's the here's the difference you can schedule this now or you can schedule this later if you do it for later what's going to happen is it's going to create a page and it's going to have a little timer click down of when it's going to start i'm going to show you that one because that one will actually be pretty awesome it doesn't matter at all this stuff honestly uh, select what you want to do here like I'm just gonna make it public so everybody can see it all right it just makes it easier uh, if you did it now you would still get this same pop-up I believe because it will just go to it's gonna create an event page for your video all right so once it loads it's gonna create an event page for me so here's my event page for a test hangout video now if I were to hit the start button here what you're gonna see is it's gonna show the day the hour and the minutes until it starts and it will literally start counting down minutes as well so that's really really cool tells who it's hosted by and then right here tells you what the video is so as people come and they join it will have a join button here so they can say you're joining you're coming to the hangout and you can get a list of people who are coming you can invite people over here you can message people you can share the event on your page you can edit the event and add you know whatever you want to here if you see something that you want to add here we'll do the pretty little ladybugs so now when this loads you're gonna see the pretty little ladybugs so I mean it's it's really easy it's quick if you want to do Q&A click this and now you're enabling the question app so when you're on the hangout you can sit here and watch people as they ask questions so it's kind of cool it's, it's definitely it's definitely unique but because I want to start this now so here is my questions I can ask a question here how do you do that so now that's going to sit there and it's asking a question so when somebody comes on and they can see it, I'll be able to see the questions that they're asking. All right. So let's go ahead and start this. Again, it opens the same way as the one on YouTube, except this time we have an event page and this time we will have an event link. All right. So remember that event pages have an event link to that page because that's where you're going to want to send people to watch. So if you're going this route, have them watch on the Google Hangout page and they can ask questions, interact, and all that good jazzy stuff. So just like the other one, you have the links button down here. Let me go ahead and make that full. You still have the video embed. You still have the YouTube page and it will work out the same way. Let me, let me do that and we'll uh, pull that open real fast. So if you were to watch it on YouTube, what's going to happen is it's going to have the countdown just the same. Except this is live on my page right now. So if you were to go to my page, you'd see that I have a live broadcast getting ready to start in one day, one hour, 32 minutes, and 31 seconds, 30 seconds. Yeah. So it's really, really cool. This is very proficient, and I love it. All right, so let's go back down to the Hangout. All right, so now you've seen that. The only thing I would recommend here is you have your little stuff over here so q a let's open q a so now that i have q a open as i'm doing my broadcast as you see on the screen i've opened up this q a on the left hand panel and now i'm able to see how do you do that all right so once it starts i'm going to be able to answer these questions live on hangout so as people ask questions, it's going to pop up here on this on this uh, question and answer thing. So I'll be able to see it. I'll be able to answer it. And it's really, really neat. I love, I love what they give you. But the next one is the uh, Hangout Toolbox. Now, this is really cool, too. I think I need to turn this this way for a second. Let's see if I can hook up this other camera as I'm working and tweaking. 
that way I can do like a live hangout with you all right and let's see if that works I'm gonna have two videos going so it's gonna be really really slow so we'll see if that works it may not because I'm on a hangout I've got a camera running but that's cool all right so on the Google I wanted to show you the actual toolbox but the toolbox allows you to have that lower third you know you see people's names at the bottom that's what this is for so you can put your name your tagline you can choose to enter in a picture or you can do custom overlays which you can't see on mine because it's not working so sorry about that uh, another cool thing that you need to know this is one of those you need to know when you're doing a hangout if somebody is talking you want the camera focused on them so in case I'm sitting here fiddle farting around or I, I have my awaken thunder which is very very good 10 calories no sugar all natural energy drink and I set that down and you hear that can drop it's gonna come to my camera so what I like to do is if someone is speaking I like to put the actual box around their picture so if you look right here right where I am there's a white box around it if I uncheck it there's no white box it means the cameras floating around it's going from person who's making noise whose camera or microphone is picking up the the voice or the timber whatever the can dropping the air cutting on me snapping my finger so if someone is talking you click on the their, their picture for me it's an icon and you keep it on there and it will not move off my camera this will stay on my camera the entire time now I was gonna do a live broadcast because I guess I can real fast here's what you do you hit start broadcast says okay going live but about three four seconds is what it takes you'll hear a ding a second ding and it'll go live one ding and then right here it says starting and that'll turn red second ding now we're on a live broadcast you're starting you're recording uh, if I were to come back over here to my page and refresh you're going to see that we're on here well it's oh I've got a set for a different day so actually that should not actually be uh, playing yet but on the Google Hangout page it will uh, it's like a five second or 20 second delay something like that so we'll refresh this and now you'll see well it's still not doing on YouTube that's crazy it's crazy it's nuts but it is on this one so you'll be able to see the video that I'm recording now on this so I'm gonna go ahead and close this out real fast and open up my other one and I'm going to stop broadcast wish them a farewell allow everybody to say their goodbyes and then stop broadcast and that's it and right now you hear it in the background as in uh, the YouTube page is actually playing so <laughs> let me mute this actually no. so if you've got the event page set up here's the cool thing and they're watching you on a Google Hangout on YouTube there's this little button at the lower left here it says join the live Q&A on Google Hangouts so if I select that it's gonna go back to Google Hangouts and it's gonna pop up this chat All right. and it's giving me that opportunity so so guys honestly this is one of the most important tools that I have video is king when it comes to marketing because you can get so many more interactions more value to the marketplace doing video than you can anything because nine times out of ten people don't want to read your crap you know what I'm saying they just don't I don't I hate reading crap I read my inspirational I read my marketing I read my simple freedom booklets that I pass out everywhere and make sure that everybody understands what simple freedom is all about plug but I, I do it for video because people will watch a video people want to learn and be engaged entertained so if you can do something that will pull them in 
you got a better shot of getting your message out. So I hope this was helpful. If it was, comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. Leave me a comment wherever you're watching this at, whether it's on my blog, on a video, on, uh, on Facebook, Google+, Plus, wherever. Let me know what you thought. And again, I know this is long, but I wanted to show you everything that you're going to need to operate a Google Hangout. So it's easy. It's not hard. Don't be scared because anybody can do this. And so can you. All right. So it's your boy Big Chips here representing Simple Freedom. Make it a great day. I dare you.